All right, and we're back. Oh, is this is yeah, rec mm, yeah, recording? It's off about three seconds. All right. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. And we're back to uh, finish this uh, game up tonight. I uh, hope everybody had a good New Year's Eve. I'm gonna shoot that camera. Go ahead and get that out of the way. Hope everybody had a good New Year's Eve and uh, didn't do nothing crazy and silly. Well, I did. I drank a lot. But, um, yeah, I hope y'all didn't do nothing silly or stupid, make y'all end up getting in trouble. But, yeah, Happy New Year's Eve and, uh, Happy Late Christmas, too, because I was with my family Christmas, so I really couldn't do that much, uh, do that much recording. But now it's a new year and big things are about to happen. Can't really say much because it's going, it's like a spoiler, but it's going to be a lot of stuff I'm going to add to my channel, so it's going to be all good. But this part is basically a lot of talking. Just, yeah, see? I'm just, like, I'm gonna be quite half the time. Snake, it's me. What's wrong? Did you find a good place to hide? Yeah, thanks to the stealth gear. Of course. It looks like they've finished getting Metal Gear ready. How do you know that? I overheard them talking. Where are you now? Right in front of Metal Gear. But it's strange. What is? There's nobody here. No guards, no mechanics. It's too quiet. Maybe because they're all ready. They said they even input the PAL codes. What should I do? All we can do is use the override system that President Baker told you about. But I've only got one of the three keys. And besides that, like Ocelot said, there's some trick to using the keys. Leave it to me. You got some kind of plan? Well, I'm in the computer room right now. I'm trying to access Baker's private files. Baker's files? Don't you need a password? Of course. But there are ways. Are you a hacker? Yep. That describes me pretty well. <laughs> Does it look Stupid. like you can get in? I don't know yet. I'll give it a try. I'm counting on you. I'm counting on you. Anyway, uh Oh yeah. Okay. Um I'm going ahead and introduce uh Natasha since we never got a chance to talk to her. I'm going to get that out of the way. This is Nastasha Romanenko. A pleasure to work with you, Salad Snake. You're the nuclear specialist that the colonel mentioned. That's me. How are you talking with a cigarette in your mouth like that? that you want. I am also a military Nothing analyst. I'm catching a cold, so man. I can't, I like, stop coughing. Of so if you hear some, like, well. clicking in and out they with the mic, that's me turning my mic off. So I'm not, like, coughing all in and hurting y'all ears. Search team. So if you hear like a loud squeaking, not squeaking sound, like a click or something, that's me turning my mic off. Kind. I hope I can help you to stop them. You're a tough lady. Those terrorists are serious about launching a nuclear weapon. Of course, the world they're cannot terrorists. stand by idly and allow that to happen, and neither can I. Unfortunately, all I can do from here is provide you with information. Hopefully, that'll be enough. Another soldier here wouldn't make a difference anyway. It's good to work with you, Nastasha. Same here, Snake. There you go. Alright, let's go ahead and get this out of the way. Hold up. Call Colonel, too. Call Colonel. The less you maneuver a remote-controlled missile, the faster it will fly. Remember this if you want to fire the missile over a greater distance. Oh, you're talking about freaking Nikita. Whatever. I thought you were going to say something like... Important. Uh oh. Is there somebody there? Soldiers coming. Huh? I'm just gonna kill both of y'all. I was not expecting that to happen, honestly. Go ahead and get you out of the way. <laughs> I did not expect that to happen, y'all. I really didn't. I I didn't know they could hear me. Oh well, takes care of them. Not my way. I guess Snake got some heavy feet. Come on down the stairs. <coughs> Excuse me. He must be real heavy, cause Snake look like he's like having a hard time dragging his body. Put that 
right there. Wow, that was weird. Alright, let's go ahead and go up the stairs. I was gonna change my settings, but I okay, never mind. Snake, it's me again. Duh. How's it going? Um, not bad. I just got past his third security level. He was a pretty careful guy. Do you think you'll break in soon? I've never met a system I couldn't bust into. Okay, keep trying. Yeah, keep trying while I look for more ammo. Yeah, there's a lot of freaking chaz. Oh yeah, I need chaz. It ain't no stinger. I get my gun out. No, nope, ain't no more shooting. I ain't worried about it. But yeah, hopefully everybody had a good New Year's. Uh, God darn it. Snake, I did it. You got that security? Bingo. Great. So what do you got? I accessed the confidential Metal Gear file. So what about the PAL override system that Baker talked about? Haven't found it yet. That's what I need to know. But Snake, I found something else. What? The secret behind the new nuclear weapon. Just as I thought. The nuclear warhead is designed to be fired from the railgun like a projectile. It doesn't use fuel, so it isn't considered a missile. That way it can get around all sorts of international treaties. Pretty sneaky. Yes, but effective. And that's not even the scariest thing about this weapon. Mm, I can't wait to hear this. It's a stealth weapon. You mean, it won't show up on radar? Yeah. The truth is, they've been working on a stealth missile since the late 70s. Why weren't they able to develop one up until now? Because of the missile's rocket propulsion system. It would be picked up by enemy satellites. Because of that? But unlike a missile, the railgun doesn't burn any propellant. So it can't be detected by any current ballistic missile detection systems. Whoop, there you go. An invisible nuclear warhead. Totally impossible to intercept. And on top of that, it's got a surface-piercing warhead designed to penetrate hardened underground bases. We learned that lesson in the Gulf War. This thing could mean the end of the world. It's the ultimate weapon. All ten and from weapon. a political point of view, it avoids the problem of nuclear reduction and nuclear inspections. Colonel, is this true? Are you listening? I'm listening. It would push back the signing of the START III Treaty. If word gets out about this weapon, it'd cause a whole world of trouble. Whoop. Yeah, it would be nasty. The United States would be denounced by the UN. It could even bring the president down. Did you know this, Colonel? Of course he I'm did. Sorry. You've changed, Colonel. I won't make any excuses. Of course Snake, he knew. Listen to me. This new nuclear weapon, it's never actually been tested. Only simulated. You mean with VR experiments? Yeah. That's why they were conducting this exercise. They needed to get actual experimental data to back up the simulation. What were the results of the exercise? It looks like it went better than they hoped for, but I can't find the data anywhere on this network. You'd think the data as important as that would be carefully recorded. It was. President Baker gave me an optical disk with all of the test data. Ooh. What? Do you still have it? No. Oslot took it from me. Damn. The terrorists have replaced the dummy warhead with a real warhead. Once they input the detonation codes, they should be ready to launch. So, you think they can do it? Of course. Well, the dummy warhead was designed to be identical to the real thing, so I think so. Did you find out how to override it yet? Not yet. It must be in a separate file. Right now I'm looking through all of Baker's personal files. We're counting on you. Heck yeah, man, we count on you. We gotta stop Metal Gear. Anything down here? Anything down here? No. Bandages. You know, freaking bandages. I don't need a band aid. Snake likes get like two steps. Anybody in front of me? Nope. Alright, cool. Anything over here? Yep. Give me that. Nope. Promise y'all, you get me ready for something. Okay, two. What? 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 What happened? Snake. 
Did you find it? No, I haven't found out about the override system yet, but I found Baker's ulterior motive. He's just looking to get rich, isn't he? Yep. That's part of it. Armstech is in much worse financial trouble than I thought. Uh, I know they lost their bid to make the next generation fighter jet. That, plus the reduction in SDI spending. It looks like there was even some talk of a hostile takeover. Uh -uh. Everything was riding on this project, I guess. And it looks like they were paying a lot of bribe money to the DARPA chief. Bribe money, huh? Yeah. And Baker was a big proponent of the nuclear deterrent theory. I see. So anyway, what about the override? Just give me a little bit longer. Mm -hmm. Give me as much time as we can. Let's see. Are they up there? Yeah, they up there. Can't see them, but they up there. How, how come the soldier heard me, but they can't hear me? That don't make no sense. Well, to a cutscene. Whatever, man. Okay, I've entered the PAL codes and disengaged the safety device. We can launch any time. There's still no response from Washington. It looks like we'll have to show them that we mean business. <laughs> Come on. Should I set it for Chernatin, Russia? No. There's been a change. The new target is Lotnor, China. Why, boss? Yeah, he's still alive. Liquid. I'm sure neither you nor Mr. Golukovich would really like to see a nuclear bomb dropped on your motherland, right? But why? There's nothing there. Wrong. It's a nuclear test site. Mm. A nuclear test site. If we nuke a major population center, the game's over. But a nuclear explosion at a test site can still be concealed from the public. Meanwhile, Washington will be worried about the retaliatory strike from China. That'll probably mean top secret talks between both countries' leaders. Of course. And in the process, the president will be forced to divulge the existence of a new and highly destabilizing nuclear weapon to the Chinese. What do you think that will do to the U.S.'s reputation? Ooh. Or the president's? And with the CTBT, that means that China and India... I see. <laughs> <laughs> yes. When the other countries hear about the new weapon, they'll all want to contact us. Washington won't be very happy when we start selling their own system to the highest bidders. Yes, the president will break. He will give in to our demands. Text message. Big Boss's DNA and one billion dollars. One billion dollars? All for money. That's what I'm saying. That money will be used to cure our genome soldiers as well. I'm also including the fox dye vaccine in our demands. Fox dye? It killed Octopus and the arms tech president. So it's true that it affects older people first. Mantis See, Snake, right there should tell you something, dude. Because wore a mask. That should tell Wolf you something. wasn't infected either. Perhaps due to those tranquilizers she always took. Something to do with amphetamine and adrenaline levels in the blood. They deployed a product still in development into live combat. No surprise it was unreliable. They must have been desperate. Of course. Trying to kill y'all. In any case, have you heard from your friend Colonel Sergei Golukovich at Spetsnaz yet? He still has doubts about the ability of Metal Gear. He said we can talk after Metal Gear's test launch is successful. Oh, there you go. Hmm. He is a very prudent man. There's nothing to worry about. The Colonel wants Metal Gear and a new nuclear weapon so bad he can taste it. If Russia wants to regain its position as a military superpower, they need to reinforce their nuclear arsenal. They need a nuclear weapon that can't be intercepted. Metal Gear will allow them to gain first strike capability over the rest of the world. Yeah, it's a lot of talking, sorry, y'all. <laughs> They're 